I'm Chris Nolden. I'm with uh, Lake Region State College, Dakota Precision Ag Center. I'm the Precision Ag Tech Specialist there at the Ag Center. Uh, we're we are grant funded to create a new program out of the college. It will be a two-year AAS in precision agriculture. And with that degree, uh, we're looking to be able to get our students out into uh, farm equipment dealerships, uh, agronomy centers, uh, places as such. And uh, we're trying to uh, help fill the need for educated personnel in, in, the, in the field basically. Yeah, uh, we've actually had a lot of a lot of industry, you know, people coming at us from industry looking for people. Every, everybody from in the United States from Winfield to, you know, just about every agriculture dealership in our area. Uh, we've also had a lot of contact from the conglomerate uh, agricultural dealership conglomerate up in Canada uh, which basically they've told us they would take every graduate that we can put out for the next four to five years at you know 48 graduates per graduation cycle uh, and, and that's and they say that would only fill about half of what they consider their need right now <laughs> so that means their true need is probably somewhere in the order of you know 600 people give or take and uh, we're just doing what we can to to fill to fill that need uh, we've also gotten a lot of um, inquiry from them about possibly setting, you know, not, I don't want to say franchising, but almost franchising out our training or, you know, making our modules available uh, at, a, at a distance, you know, uh, online style or be it through interactive video networks or, or, or things of that nature. Um, they're interested in about it. <laughs> Any, any which way they can get, you know, so. Uh, right now, our, our main plan is we're, we're using two uh, advisory committees, all comprised of industry and field-related people. Um, we're also in the process of working with agriculture dealerships uh, and agronomy, both dealers and, you know, custom agronomy centers on getting our, our internships worked through there so that um, each one of our students will be able to get some real world experience. I mean, if they didn't have any experience, say, coming you know, off their own family farm or this or that, uh, it will be a requirement of our program for our students to go work out in real life agricultural settings. Uh, <laughs> I, I would expect that uh, the dealerships treat our interns just like they would treat an employee, you know, um, throwing them out in the, in the, in the spring <laughs> when uh, everything is, is coming crunching down and uh, just giving them the opportunity to, to put to use what they've learned in electronics, computers, and uh, agronomy through the program.